Hi guys, welcome to a new video. Today's video, I'm going to be walking you through my mom's childhood home. And keep in mind, this was built in the 1960s and it's been around for a while. We are having it like professionally cleaned soon and it will be on the market, the real estate market soon. Before we get into it, make sure you are subscribed to my channel and press the little bell. Also follow me on Instagram. It would mean the absolute world to me. And I guess without further ado, let's just get on to the house tour. Okay, so this is the house tour of 511 East 2nd Street, Wellston, Ohio. Let's go on inside. So the first thing you see when you walk in is gonna be this great foyer. And you can see the big beautiful chandelier, big staircase. When you go to the right, you have a living room. This is a formal living room, I believe. So this is what it looks like. Going to the left is the formal dining room here. Beautiful. Inside here, we have our kitchen. Nice avocado green. Pretty. Here's the regular dining room, dining area. We have two ovens and a little dishwasher over there and stove, everything you would find in a kitchen. This is the family room in here. And then you get this beautiful view of the backyard, which there's endless possibilities that someone could do to renovate it and get it looking pretty. Moving over here, we have, we have the Florida room or sun room as they call it. Beautiful open area out here. It's still inside the house, but it's kind of outside. This is what the back patio looks like. And this is another view of the backyard. And yes, that used to be a fountain. There was water coming down there at one time. Um, but yeah, this is the back patio. That's just another way into the hallway to the front of the house. I wanna make sure I show you guys everything. So this is a black and white themed bathroom with a black toilet. Valerie would love for me to say that she designed this bathroom. That's why it looks different than all the other rooms here. So we have a shower here. Just looks like a normal shower. And then the black toilet. I always thought that was really cool. Then we have tons of storage. This house always has had so much storage. So there's plenty of room to store things. Um, and then here is the mirror and sink area. This is, it goes down into the basement, which is just a basement. It's not like furnished or anything. Then we're gonna go upstairs. And up here, we're gonna go to the left. This room is a dressing room for Valerie. Uh, I guess it's just where you like would get prepared for the day. And this is Valerie's bedroom in here. Very big bedroom. This is like my room times like six. <laughs> so this was her bedroom. She had like white and gold furniture. Moving in here, this is a closet area. So this is where they would store all their clothes. And yes, this is like someone's closet dream. Oh, this must be the crawl space. 
So that's a crawl space. It looks like it. I don't know. Or the attic. I don't think that's the attic though. Um, but yeah, this is a closet. And then you guys will see here um, when I go around. But this goes into, into another part of the house. So it's kind of like a little shortcut, which I'll show you guys. So coming on out of here, you can either go down this hallway or you can go through the bathroom because there was like sharing bathrooms, I guess. So we have a tub here and we have two sinks, obviously, another chandelier here. Um, very pretty gold finish on this, like hardware. Uh, moving on over here. Oh, I guess there's a nice little window here. You can see some of the backyard again. Moving down here, we have the toilet and the bidet. They actually had a bidet, which is like kind of crazy. And in here, we have Valerie's parents' dressing room area. So they each like had a dressing room. Um, and then this was her parents' room. And there's, I guess, still a TV here. So that's her parents' room. And then moving in here, this is another closet. So this was full of clothes, as you can imagine. It's like every girl's dream to have like a huge closet. Like that's another room, I'm telling you. Um, so now we're gonna go back downstairs. So we've already seen pretty much everything downstairs. You guys saw the kitchen, we saw the family room, we saw the sunroom. That door leads you out to the garage, which is just a garage, so, you know, nothing fancy there. Moving on up, we go up these stairs, and this is an attached garage apartment where they used to live. So, for context, this is where they originally lived, and then they built on all of this other stuff. I know it's kind of confusing, but... Here we have just a closet. As you guys just can already tell, there's a bunch of storage and everything that's crazy. In here, another closet. So it just looks like that. I like the shadows there, that's cute. This is the door that I was um, kind of explaining to you guys. So that is upstairs um, where we just were in Valerie's closet. So as you guys can see for concept, purposes. I don't want to bang my head. Apparently everyone bangs their head on this thing. So you kind of have to like duck. But then we're back up in Valerie's closet, make a right and you're in Valerie's room again. So I know that's kind of confusing, but that is the little like secret passageway, <laughs> one might say, in this house, which is pretty cool. Like I'm oh whoops that kind of shut loud. Okay, and then coming on in here, this is just another living room, and this is what it looks like. It's beautiful. They have a beautiful brick fireplace there. Then turning around here, they have even more storage, so there's tons of cabinets and everything. So this is a good, nice size living room, and as I just said, this was a garage apartment, so um, it's pretty cool. Coming in here, we have the second kitchen. I know there's like two kitchens in this house, it's crazy. Um, so we have the little bar here and the sink, stove, etc. Again, tons of cabinet space. There's the stove, the sink, and then more cabinets and stuff. Then over here we have, this is probably like the little, oh, this is a utility closet here. Um, I guess that's what it is. So uh, moving on over here, this door goes out. It's kind of like a little patio. This was a patio, but they turned it into like, I don't know, just like this little enclosed area here. Very cool, very cool. And gonna close that and then moving on over here guys this room is crazy you guys this is the best part so this is the hot tub room so we have a cute little sink here 
I mean, look at that. That is adorable. That is some beautiful light fixtures there. We have a toilet here. Toilet paper. That's like a little cutout to get to the toilet. Valerie was saying that the toilet used to be here. So that's cool. And then moving on in here, we have the hot tub room. So this room was never really used, I guess, but they put a hot tub here. It's pink. And then we have the green here. Beautiful light fixtures again. Just such a stunning room. This is probably my favorite room in the entire house. They have a shower. Beautiful lights. And then they just had like stuff around here, but it's all cleaned out now. And then they could take a peek out at their backyard. So if they were to open this up, they could see some of their backyard, which is pretty cool. This is definitely my favorite room. I love it so much. And again, more storage over here. And then the shower is even like a pink color. It's more of like dull than the camera's picking up. It's making it more bright, but it's more of like a dull, like blush pink type of deal. And then this was actually Valerie's old room when she was like a little kid. But this is another bedroom in the garage apartment section. And then we have the closet there. And it's pretty much it for the garage apartment. And I guess that concludes our tour of 511 East 2nd Street. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I also did want to mention that this is another door you can get in on the side. So um, this was like a little mud room area. It wasn't like a room, but you would like take off your shoes here and then just like come into the house. So that's kind of where like everyone enters. They don't really enter through the main door. So I hope you guys enjoyed this house tour. It was super fun to film and I'm so glad I have the memories to keep for my mom and everything. I mean, it's just so nice to have and we have the technology now where we can keep such cool memories and everything. So I'm really grateful for that. Leave in the comments down below, what was your favorite room? I think my favorite room was the hot tub room or maybe even the sun room. That was a really pretty room. Just let me know what your favorite room was because I would love to know. I think that's gonna be it. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!